Hi there, I'm Jared Fuller, childhood cancer survivor and advocate. As many of you know, uh, September is Childhood Cancer Awareness Month. And one thing I hear quite frequently from uh, children and families, uh, and I've met a lot of warriors over the past five years that I've been advocating for awareness. Um, one line I hear a lot is, Jared, you inspire me. I look up to you. You are a living miracle. You are uh, everything that we look for in a person who survived. You are a warrior. You you are so passionate about what you do. Um, you know, you inspire us. You're our inspiration, and, and we look up to you. As flattering as that is to me, and I love each and every warrior and family that I've ever had a chance of getting to know, the fact of the matter is, I don't do it for the kudos. I don't do it for the notoriety or the pat on the back. I do it because childhood cancer is something that we were all involuntarily thrust into. We didn't have a choice in the matter. We didn't have a say in this. This is something that just happens. And while I am very flattered that people look up to me as a source of inspiration and, and guidance and, um, you know, people turn to me for uh, just the talks when I voice my opinion or when I give my uh, thoughts on something, people turn to me and they get the inspiration from that. It, the truth of the matter is I'm actually more inspired by all of you. You inspire me more than anything else in the world. You inspire me. And while I am, again, like I said, I'm flattered by the wonderful comments I've gotten from people over the course of the past five years, the fact of the matter is all of you inspire me to continue doing what I do. Now, let's say, for example, I stop being an advocate for childhood cancer, for whatever the case may be. Let's say I just peel that layer off. I'm still a survivor. I'm still gonna have stories to tell. I'm still gonna have poems to write. I'm still gonna have shirts to make. Um, you know, the bird shirts that I make for the warriors. Um, the truth of the matter is that all of you keep me going. And I have so much love in my heart for all of the warriors, all of the families I've had a chance to meet, in spite of all the other not so good things that have happened over the course of the past five years, um, I just want everybody to know that for what it's worth, you enriched my life. And advocate or no advocate, I'm still gonna have stories to tell. I'm always going to be a survivor. And I'm always going to carry you and my heart. Have a good day.